Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to another episode of Pacific Drive. Today, well, shocker, we're going to go on another drive, and nothing bad could possibly happen in this game, right? We're actually not going on a drive right away, though, because if you remember, uh, I can't even go on a drive if I wanted to. We have to find Oppie's hideaway. Now, we did unlock the bathroom, and I thought that would be the hideaway because that was the one that was locked at the start of this introduction. She kind of locked it, if you remember, and I couldn't get in. All right, there is things I can use. Hold on. Okay. Uh. Well, that was easy. Does nobody blow their hands in this game? I feel like that's a bad idea for a button to open up your secret hideaway. That was way too easy. First thing I freaking tried. Hopefully this episode keeps going this well. Okay, what is this? Arc Doc. What else do we have in here? Hold on, there's a hard drive in here. There might be some intel here. Hold on. Send the drive to Tobias and Francis. Do I finally get to use this machine? I was wondering what this thing was going to be for. It's been in since the demo of the game. So now we can finally do it. So I put the hard drive in. Can't put the item... Aww. Wait, 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 wait. Stop. Why? I just wanted to use this machine. Wait, do... Oh. So it goes in the out because it's going out. I'm not very smart. <laughs> I thought it went in the in because that's where you're putting it in. <laughs> Okay, Oppie's back. Me? Loud and clear, you old bat. <laughs> I see. The comms clear up suddenly, and I find you two patched into the garage frequency. <laughs> it all makes sense now. So, Oppie, what's the, uh, what's the plan? You must have some grand scheme, don't you? Let me get this straight. You hijacked my mission, tapped into my frequency, and now you want to be all buddy-buddy. Not on your life. You think this goes. you're hot stuff. Why don't you take the lead then? Get the driver through all by your damn selves. Oppie is so angry. Did she just hang up on us? <laughs> we know the driver needs to get to the deep zone, but it's too dangerous to head there directly. We have to zero in on exactly where to go. The signal amplification trick won't work here. The ambient instability is too strong in the mid zone. There was one other time where the mass hallucination and the remnants intersected. Drive, I've tagged a route for you. Whenever okay. you're ready, give it a spin. All right, well, it doesn't sound like we know really where we're going just yet, but uh, they tagged me a route, so I guess we're going to be doing that route in the near future here. Wow. We have unlocked a lot of this map. Okay. What? Before I was right here, now we have all these new areas to go to. This is kind of cool. Uh, which one am I supposed to go to? I'm assuming it, yeah, it's this one, obviously. All right, so yeah, I guess we'll prep for that. I got to figure out how to use this arc device. Okay, so this case gives me first aid. However, the energy this requires will put a substantial drain on the battery. So do I uninstall the old one? Because I believe this is an arc. Oh, it's not even... Okay. I... <laughs> I thought I had to, like... I thought I already had the one here, but no. I guess I'm installing on top of it. So now it should heal me? Uh, that makes me consider maybe getting... I had one upgrade I wasn't going to get. I should also mention that uh, before I recorded this episode, I purchased all my upgrades. So the first thing we bought was lead-plated paneling. So I got a couple doors with that because that's all the lead I had. I also put an insulated bumper on so that will insulate me from electrical attacks. I did get the upgraded antenna too. Not really sure what that does. I guess, okay, that checks out. That's probably why I see so many roadways now so I can actually see them thanks to that antenna. And I think that is pretty much it for new upgrades if you are following along. So yeah, I did see I have available, or at least I did. Yeah, the plasma charger. Now, I know I have no plasma right now. I think I have one, actually. Um, so I don't know if I'll be able to get this or not. I actually already have one. I found one, but I want to be able to make my own as well. If we're going to be able to heal with our car at the expense of battery energy, I want to make sure I can re-energize that thing easily. So yeah, we have the plasma charger now. And yeah, as I said, I don't have any plasma right now, unfortunately. Well, one. All right, so next spot, six hours this way. Hopefully, wow, that is so many jumps. Uh, <laughs> we'll see if we can make it there or not. It's been about a week since I last played, since I prepped a lot of recordings, so we'll see if I'm still rusty or not. Okay, I really got to get anomalies, too. I've been, I've been being locked behind a lot of things I need to scan, so we're going to be doing that. What the hell is this, by the way? Lead shielding! Oh, yes, please. Don't mind if I do. There we go. That is a major upgrade for the car. I only have two lead doors, so I need three more. And, well, the paneling as well, of course. And myself a friend, a happy hair. Always good to see these guys. So we'll throw them on the old uh, truck and it should heal us. So you can stay for as long as you want, sir. 
Look at that. He actually healed my panel. Dude, that's so cool. I love that. That's the one thing in this game that's nice to you. It's kind of nice to find those. Well, these are my new favorite areas. I found another one of these lead plating zones. So, uh, might have a full lead car by the end of this run. Okay, we got a storm warning. So, I think I actually... Oh, I got so much I need to do down here. I do not want to risk it, though, being that we... Damn it, I got my cork again. Uh, I do not want to <laughs> risk it, though. Being that we have a long road ahead of us, I'm just going to head back to the main road here. Oh, I really want to go this way because this looks like a really cool zone. Plus, I would get into the mid zone right now, but I feel like let's stay, let's stay with the quest line. Unfortunately, it even warns me on the map it's dark over here. And well, we've been here already. It was very, very dark. So hopefully it's not the same as before. Oh, yeah. Well, shocker. It is uh, Midnight Forest. Oh, I hate it already, dude. Why is it so red? I just kind of want to get out of this zone because I want to get to the mid zone. We got to get more unstable energy. So I'm going to head down this road and screw all this. I have lots of loot. Uh, now that I have this lead plating as well, that's all I really needed. All right. Well, this is going to hurt. Oh, actually, I need to get these things. Hold on. I think I need to do these things. Let me just double check. Don't shock me. Minute man. Yes. Ha ha. I also just learned that scanning them makes them hide. So I didn't need to take their damage this whole time. Good to know. All right, we're nearing the end of this runway. I'm going to keep going. I haven't found many vehicle wrecks. I have no duct tape right now, which is a very common item in this game. So I need duct tape for a lot of things. I want to hopefully find some crashes. I also need some gas. So I need to either siphon some gas or find a gas station. So we just need to get out of here and get to the next zone. All right, so now we can either go to G2 or D2. We got to go to D2 regardless of if we go to G2 or not. So let's get to D2 so we go to the uh, actual zone as quickly as possible. This is going to be the first rough one, though. We're in a storm, so uh, car's doing pretty good. I just got a loose wheel. I got to find some damn duct tape for it. All right, at least it's one straight road, so it's going to be very hard for me to get lost. Especially eruptive. What does that mean? Fuel evaporation? No! I don't got time for fuel evaporation right now. Now I'm freaking out, so I'm going to have to go pretty fast through this. What are these blue zones, by the way? I don't think I've seen those before. All right, and already, already it's insane. Great. Oh, yeah, that, that, that's a good start. Thanks. Okay, so I see these. I'm trying to remember what the little mushroom things were that I collected. Are these them? No. I need them for the blowtorch, so I very much want to collect those things as well. We're in the mid zone now, so we should be able to find them. Oh, yeah, here we go. That's them. That's the things I recognize. So 80 of these freaking things are what I need to get it. And it's like, I collect one at a time. So I got to sit here like a maniac. Is there, is there a... Oh, I wonder if this is what the vacuum's for. I just thought of that. Oh, I can't even craft it. I'm assuming that's why you want the hand vac, though. I was always wondering why you would get that. Because it's pretty easy to loot in this game. But if you have to collect a bunch of these all at one at a time, that's insane. I'm just going to collect enough to make one blowtorch right now. Oh, and I guess the storm went away. So that's nice. Uh, what are you? What the frig are you? Just floating there, staring at me all creepy-like. Can I scan you? Hello. Oh, it's a pickpocket. Uh, yeah, don't steal from me, maybe? Oh, duct tape. I got duct tape. Oh, are you serious? I'm full. <laughs> okay, and I needed that for the mechanics kit. Because I got a loose freaking wheel here that's making me drive slow. So smack it. And there we go. We're back in business. Now I just got to get beyond this pickpocket thing. Hey there, big guy. Just uh, ignore me. I'm going to go this way, okay? You just keep floating there all creepy-like. Thank you. Oh, God, it's following me. I knew I would do it. Oh, freak off. What did you steal? What is that? What actually is that? What, what, what did I lose? Okay, hold on. It's it's taunting me. You little bastard. You're a little bastard. You know that? G give me my thing back. What is that? What did you even steal? I feel like this is a trap. What, what the hell did you even give me? Thank you. So oh, it's my side storage. It literally takes things off my car. You bastard, that's where a, a lot of my meds are. I don't like that. Are my meds still in there? Oh, I grabbed them. That's right, thankfully. Um, But yeah, that's concerning. Okay, he's just doing it again. Frig off! This dude is the ultimate troll in this game. I'm trying to avoid you. You've already stolen one thing. Don't do it again. Please? I want to scan this. I want to see what this is. This new zone's so exciting. This has got to be scannable. Giant orb. All right, that thing's going to blow up or something. I'm not going to go near it. Didn't really say much about it, but I'm not going to risk it. All right, so yeah, I just say I think I have to beeline it because this zone is continuously shrinking. So yeah, I guess we're just going to have to go to the next zone. One thing I do actually need, though, is power. We have to worry about jumping once we're done this. So I'm going to go grab this anchor that's right beside the road here. 
There's also a blue thing there. I wonder if I should go for that or not because the zone's shrinking. I don't think I should even go for the uh, power, honestly. This zone's shrinking, seems like, pretty quickly. Now, you know what? I don't, I don't think it is. I think I'm going to go for it here. Oh, it's a red one, too. Okay, that was definitely worth it. I should have been focusing way more on unstable than I have been. Well, there sure is a lot of things going on now. I guess taking this was a bad idea. I am very, very radiated right now. All right, and yeah, that is closing in behind me, so. Oh, I wish I knew that. I didn't even think about it. I need more unstable. I need lots of unstable. Excuse me, tourists. Freak off, thank you very much. What the hell is that? Oh God, I gotta scan it. Screw, it's gonna damage me. Scan. What the hell are you? Scan. Ah, I don't like it. Oh God. Oh God, oh my God, there's goo everywhere. There's goop everywhere. Okay, okay. You know what? This was peaceful for a second, so I thought, you know what? This is kind of nice. I'm just gonna explore this and have all fun. Now there's new things shooting goop at me and crap. And yeah, the thing is slowly shrinking behind me. I am just holding ahead of it. Damn it. It's so exciting seeing some new things that will try and kill me though. What the frig is that? Oh God, oh God, I don't know what that is. I don't know if it's alive or not. Oh God. Hello? Oh! Wait, is that an anchor? That is not an anchor. What is that? Circuit gate? What the frig is a circuit gate? Ah! Oh, no, no, don't! Oh, God. Sorry? I'm sorry? Circuit gate. Oh, there's a freaking cord. I didn't even see it. It's going under my road, so I'm probably going to blow up or something in a second. Oh, there's so many new things. I'm overwhelmed. All right, I'm going to take a risk. The circuit gate is following me. Hopefully, it doesn't blow up. There are some anchors down here. It's unstable, man. I got to risk it. There's actually two down here. There's one more down there. I don't know if I'm going to go get the other one or not. All right. Got some unstable. How's this weather coming? It is coming up. I think I'm going to go with the big boy. And I'm just going to skip the other one. Actually, you know what? It's right here. I'm going to get both. Screw it. I need unstable. I'm being way too cautious. I mean, <laughs> we've seen my track record in this game. It is a bit risky. What are you? A shaggy scrambler. Don't, don't scramble me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Just, st just stay away from my car. I need to go get this thing. Is it attacking my car? It's attacking my car. It's attacking my car. <gasps> what did you do? Is it in you? Where did it go? All right. I have to figure this out later. I got to do one thing at a time. Oh, what is this circuit thing? It's literally following the road. I think I screwed up uh, doing that. Oh, we got blowy things. Oh, okay. 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 I don't... I don't like this anymore. We got this right here. We got to go for it. It's right by the roadway. All right. That is a lot of unstable energy. Oh, that feels so good. Okay. Get out of here before my car gets hit by this thing. I still don't know where that giant thing went. I still think it's in my car somewhere. Uh-oh. Yeah, there's something going on with my car, as you can clearly see. Oh, it might, it might just be battery power. I need to get to the next zone quickly because I actually don't have a jump. And I'll worry about that once we get to this zone. Ah, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're, we're okay here for a second. I don't know what the next zone is going to bring us. So we'll make a battery jumper. There you go, big guy. Get you done. I need to get out of this zone, though, because it is using fuel. And yeah, look at my fuel already. We had half fuel at the start of this. So let's just go to the next zone now. And next thing we have to worry about is fuel. I do have my spare tank, though, so it's not too scary. All right, we'll go to where Francis said we should go. And look at that, we're close to the, the deep zone, or whatever the hell they call it. Okay, ooh, this is pretty. Battery farm. Okay, first off, I've loaded up three locations on your ARC device map. Holy crap. See them? Yeah, head to whichever strikes your fancy. You, okay. You sending them to the visions? Sure am. We're gonna use this. My optical vasilizer. We shouldn't use that. Why not? Oh, great. Fart bubbles. We have to deal with fart bubbles now. What exactly does this do? Ah, oh, cough box. Stay in the car then. All right, so I'm going to try and kind of beeline it to uh, these objectives because I don't know if this place is going to get more dangerous or not. Oh, God, it's coming out through everything. That's so gross. Wow, that did a lot of damage. I shouldn't have went through that. Should not have went through that. I have a flat tire now. Um, But yeah, I'm going to go try and do these things as quickly as possible. I just lost my tire. I just actually lost my tire. Hello? Can I have my tire back? Is it gone? Oh, it's just flat then. I think. All right. Yeah, we got... <laughs> I don't know what happened, but all my tires are freaking screwed up. Well, three of them. So we need a mechanic. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I don't know what's in this zone. I'm so scared. All right. Tires are good. We'll worry about the rest of the car later. I don't feel safe here, so... 
continue forward. Grab this, and then we're gonna go figure out how to get to all three of these points. I don't know if we'll be able to do all of them. I'm hoping we can. Can you stop? Dude, what, what, what do you got? Can I have that? Please, thank you. What the hell is this? Oh, you're pulling me now. No, no, I need that back. Okay, that's my, that's my freaking front. Ah! What the frig? I don't like this. Let me go. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, you know what? You can have it. I don't care. It's my insulated panel, so I'm kind of mad about that. Uh, I wonder if I should go grab it. They're just going to destroy my car. I, I, I need to keep going. I'm actually going to die to these things. All right, now that grabby hands McGee has left me alone, let's maybe repair this thing a bit because they were ripping this thing apart, man. They seem so nice. All right, so I got one raid here. We do have to get through a river area, but I figured we'd follow this because it's kind of a point of interest on the map. So at least we know if we're following this line, we're going in the general right direction. I don't know if I should maybe walk there or what? This is pretty rough ground. All right, first time going through water. It slows me down, but it doesn't seem to do any damage. Good. Okay, good to know. So I need to scan this. I guess I could have just walked over. I should have just walked over. Uh, well, that's pretty. It's the first pretty thing I've seen in a long time in this game. The great pile up. <laughs> you know, if you uh, catch the mural at can the I get up here? When the moon doesn't look like I can. Ahead. Unfortunate. All right, so yeah, they said just go to the next zone. So it looks like at least I, I know I can walk there now. I don't know why I thought I needed my car. But yeah, we'll head back to the roadway and make our way to those zones. All right, well, actually, the next zone, there is no roadway. So we're just going to continue to follow this thing. And it's not too bad off-road right now. We got actually some nice buildings down here, too, that I might want to stop at. Assuming it's not too... Cr Whoa, too crazy? Oh yeah, this is a this is the biggest uh, mobile home that I've seen. So we gotta stop here. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! What was that? What the? Ah! No, not you again! Oh, you guys are the freaking worst! Oh, there's another one. Dude, I hate these bubble gum things. All right, yeah. If these guys are around, they're they're gonna suck the things out of my car. I need to go. Frig off! Don't suck me. Oh, that's a happy little fellow. These are kind of nice. We got a Bigfoot ah, mural. Bigfoot mural. <laughs> My personal favorite. All right, a little bit of a problem. Shocker, it's freaking duct tape again. I have no med kits. I thought I had one more. I don't. So I got to go. Again, we're just going to follow this all the way to the next zone. Seems to be that's kind of the way to do it. But yeah, I can't take damage. I don't even have much food. So I'm not going to be able to heal. Well, I think that is it right there. Okay, that was... uh. Pretty fun. Had to do a lot of off-roading at this zone. I've been taking my time, though. It's been kind of a peaceful zone in terms of storms, at least, which is nice, because I'm kind of sick of storms in this game, but it's kind of the point of the game. All right. Well, there's the final one. Let's see what we got to do from here. Oh, bingo! See that pattern in the last mural? That flower only grows above a certain elevation. Now put the three locations together, and you've got a square mile in the northeast corner of the deep zone. Huh. <gasps> is that the point in place I need to get to to get out of here? Take a look at this fine work. We've pinned down the location for the source of the mass hallucination. That's where the driver needs to go. Well, what do you know? Well, I knew the basilizer worked. What did I tell you, huh? He still doesn't know, Francis. You know what? Oh. Not my story to share. So Francis is hiding something. What is he hiding? Stop! My theory, and that vasilizer, they're, uh, illegitimate. Wait, wh what are you saying? I built that device to prove my imprint theory, and it was on the verge of getting the results I needed. But my research funding was running out. So, I forged the data. <gasps> Not much. No. Just enough to justify more time. I, I was so close. I knew the breakthrough was right around the corner. But Arda found out. That's why I was reassigned and my clearance revoked. Wait, wait. You told me you changed labs voluntarily. Eight years of research with nothing to show for it. And then, and then for that to happen, I, I couldn't face you. That doesn't mean your theory is wrong. I still think there's something to it. I'm sorry. What do you I got? Can't. What do you got? Do oh, it's a bubblegum buddy. Oppie, oh, no, it's not a buddy. It's not a buddy. I thought it was a friendly one. And demoted me to a glorified intern. 
best. She sat there and decided how best to humiliate me. I never asked for anything. This one time I do, so I would, I would never have to talk to Oppie again. You didn't listen. Your remnant was more important than what I wanted. Francis, I didn't mean... I've uh... had enough. Oh. He walked off. Oh, no, Francis. I like you, Francis. All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> I hope I don't regret this. I just kind of went for it. We should be okay. Gotta take my time through these woods here. This is definitely my best loot ever, so that's exciting. God, I hope this isn't too deep. Uh, go to a nice shallow area. Shallow enough, hopefully. What a difference, though. Last episode, I think I came back with a 1% HP. This car is just doing great now. The only thing I need is an engine. I still have my stock engine. Uh, so yeah, I should really try and work on that sooner or later here. Still have to cross this river. Oh, God. I almost ran into a car. All right. Nice and slow through the river, I guess. A little bit of damage on my crude plating. Who the hell cares? And that was easily, yeah, as I said, my most successful run. That was so nice. Okay. And back. I got so much steel plating now. I have a full inventory of junk. Well, good stuff. All right, guys, and that's going to wrap it up for this episode. So in the next episode, we're obviously going to be doing some major upgrades to this car before we go out because we got a bunch of unstable energy and some lead plating to at least put on here. Uh, then, yeah, I guess the next zone looks to be at a different part of the mid zone. So I'm kind of excited for that. I'm kind of sick of this area over here. So, uh, yeah, we'll go over there and see if we can get deeper into this quest line. As always, thanks for watching and liking, guys, and I'll see you. In the next one. Hey there. Before you go, I just wanted to let you know about my second channel, Gast. If you're missing my multiplayer shenanigans, then please consider checking it out. Scan the QR code or copy the link down below. Okay, bye. It's too bizarre. Why am I bizarre? What's wrong? That face is too... It's it's too messy. Here, put the smiler on. Somebody show him. Oh, here. Oh, my God. No, I'm keeping it.